Hello, how are you? Hello, teacher, good. Nice to see you. Vamos a ver. Hi, teacher. Hi, hi. How are you? Nice to see you. Vamos a ver. Ready here. Friday. Friday, Friday. Right? A ver. Let's see. I'm going to call you, so you please tell me present, right? Adriana Marcela. Hola, hola. Me, me escucha, teacher. Present, teacher. David. Okay, excellent, Adriana Marcela. Vamos a ver, quiero... Hey, qué chistoso. Bueno, este es el que vamos a minimizar. Okay, Adriana Marcela, present, you said, right? Yes, teacher. Okay. Ana Alicia. Ana. Carolina. Present, teacher. Claudia Carolina. Diego. Diego. Present. Edwin Mauricio. Present teacher. Elvin Alexander. Present teacher. Eh, teacher, eh, no estoy en la casa, así que solo estoy leyendo. Ok. Mm -hmm. Grace Mitchell. Present teacher. Joana. Present teacher. Jonathan Ezequiel. Jonathan. José Alfredo. Present teacher. Karen Elena. Karen Elena. Karen Janet. Present teacher. Karen Stephanie. Carla Lorena. Present teacher. Carla Patricia. Present. Luis Edgardo. Luis Edgardo. Luis Mauricio. Present teacher. Nubia. Present teacher. Rosa Hilda. Present teacher. David. Present teacher. Oscar. Beatriz. Ok. Vamos a ver. Ana here. Claudia Carolina. Jonathan. Karen Elena. Karen Stephanie. Luis Edgardo. Present teacher. Ok. Oscar. Oscar. Beatriz. Ok. Bueno. This is our class number 12. Right? We are... Mm, we have passed more than the half of the course now. But I'm going to share here.
Okay, as you know, in this unit, we are talking about human resources, right? What, what vocabulary do you know about human resources? What, core, uh, what words come to your mind when you say human resources? Mm -hmm. Recruiting. Recruiting, okay. Yes, yes. Recruiting, what else? Recruit. 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 Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Interview. Repeat. Interview. Accesses. Access. Uh -huh. Access. Potential employees. Employees. Uh -huh. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Tell me. Inquiries. Mm hmm Okay, what else? What else? Knowledge. Knowledge. Mm -hmm. A ver, mouse. Okay. What else? No more. Mm -hmm. No more. No more. No. Just two. Only. No, teacher. I don't remember. <laughs> you don't remember. <laughs> pues ni modo, ¿verdad? Vamos empezando la unidad. Al final hoy van a tener más. Vamos a ver. Okay. Now check. Here we have some jobs, right? And some characteristics of these jobs of people that work directly with human resources. And check, we have here, for example, the recruitment coordinator or recruiting coordinator. What are the characteristics of this job? Or what does this person do? Well, the recruiting coordinators facilitate the movements of candidates through the recruitment process. So if a company wants to recruit somebody or has, wants to recruit personnel, the recruiting coordinator is the one that facilitates that movement, right? Uh, their responsibilities are entail everything from posting open positions to job boards, coordinate candidate travel, scheduling interviews across the departments, handling last minute the scheduling changes. So if somebody says like, oops, no, I cannot interview this person at this time. Please tell him to come later. The recruiting coordinator is the one that has to coordinate. That's why it's a coordinator, right? A creating offer letters, conducting background checks, and smoothing over 
any other speed bumps in the hiding process. So whatever, whatever it's necessary to move, it's necessary to be done. That's the recruiting coordinator, the one that has to work with that. The job of the coordinator starts when candidates respond to job opening and ends when the organization completed that, that position, right? So if they say, okay, we have, we have, uh, or we need, for example, we need a, a seller or we need a manager, then the recruiting coordinator has to create everything, post the position, like remember yesterday, the characteristics that we were saying, that we were checking, that each uh, person should comply, right? But that's the coordinator, the one that organizes uh, like the information that will be posted. Now you can post it in many, many places, right? In the internet. Uh, so people can go check the characteristics or the requirements for that job. And they can say like, mm -hmm, yeah, I can apply or not, right? But it's the recruiting coordinator, the one in charge of the hiring, we can say all the hiring process, right? Now, we have an administrative assistant. What is the job of the administrative assistant? His job is to support, as we call assistant, right? The job of the assistant is always to depending on what is necessary to be done in the office or with the manager, with the boss, and give us support. They are responsible for managing and distributing information among the coworkers. They have to answer the funds and do other administrative work. So all administrative work go to the administrative assistant. Also, they have some responsibilities and they include making travel and meeting arrangements, preparing reports. So if they have to, the boss has to travel to another company or to another place, is the administrative assistant the one in charge to make those travel arrangements, right? Meeting arrangements preparing reports and main, maintaining appropriate filling systems. So that is all her responsibility, right? The ideal candidate should have excellent oral and written communication because he will communicate not only with the inside of the company, but also with outside the company, right? And be able to organize their work using different tools like Excel, or different, different ofimatic, right? So it should be very, very complete and do all the things that the boss needs that this person do, okay? That's the administrative assistant. And you know that this work sometimes goes um, not only inside the company, but even after, uh, after working hours, they have responsibilities that they have to comply with the company, right? And if it is necessary to work extra time, they have to do it, okay? So that's the person who's the first arriving, the last one leaving, because by the time the boss arrives, everything has to be ready. And sometimes after the, the boss leaves, they still have to see what they have to finish, right? Okay, and then we have a benefits specialist. They are a very integral part of the company, especially in the human resources department. These people that you see here, the benefit specialists, are responsible for managing and administering the company's employee benefit. That's why they worry about the benefits. What are the benefits of the employee? They are talking about the vacation, uh, bonuses, or any other benefit that they may have, um, and compensation programs. And also from retirement plans, they have to be pending on that situation, the retirement plan, and the health insurance or life insurance, right? If the company has that. 
So they worry about all the benefits of the employee in the company, okay? That's the responsibility to see that the, the, the employee is receiving everything they need. Now we have the compensation specialist. This, uh, the compensation specialist works in a company's human resource or personal department. The description varies depending on how complex the company is, right? And it depends on the size of the company and the needs of the company. Uh, in some cases, depending on the company, if it is a small company, they, they don't hire a compensation specialist. They only have a human resource generalist, right? The responsibilities of the human resource generalist uh, go from include aspects of compensation, but if the company is bigger, they need the compensation specialist because they have more advanced skills and knowledge, right? But it depends on, as I said before, on the type of company because they, uh, the compensation specialist works especially with compensation, right? Now let's go with the last one, the human resource generalist that was mentioned here. Um, this person is the first hired in a company. If a company doesn't have a big human resource department, has only a human resource generalist, okay? That would be enough. As the title suggests, this is a person with a broad range of responsibilities. Uh, so as I said before, if the company doesn't have a, a huge human resource department, like all the other people that we mentioned before, they will have only this human resource uh, generalist, right? Because they cover most of the human resource functions, they including the hiring, the compensation and benefits. That's the job of the compensation specialist, but they can uh, still exist or not in the company. If you don't have a compensation specialist in the company, the human resource, uh, the human resource generalist can cover that position, right? Also, they, uh, they cover situations like human resource administration and many other tasks. So this is like the biggest responsibility in the company. Okay, Claudia. Well, any question here? Nope. No question. No teacher, no question. Later on, and I came with that with those definitions first for each of the jobs because later on you will be using this uh, this knowledge in the previous, in the next activities, right? Okay. We have a talent management consultant. This one makes a staff development needs assessment. Remember we were talking about assessment yesterday. So this is the person who identifies and manages the trainings. And you say like, I know we have a training. Ah, okay. The responsible for giving you training is the talent management consultant. So they manage the staff training needs, and of course, always looking for quite qu high quality of the workforce, right? So depending on the type of job you have, that's the, the type of training that you will have. They also, they're also, the work, their work is to develop their skills toward greater efficiency. Or oh, they see the team or the staff is not efficient in an area, they have to manage to find or to prepare a training for people to get ready for that. I don't know if you remember like um, 2020, when we started with the pandemic and everything, right? And many things that we didn't know that we were learning or trying to learn as fast as we could because we came to learn in that way, right? And the people, uh, there were people in charge of helping all the employees get familiarized with the technology 
that we have to work that we have to use for working online right or for working in some cases for working from home right okay so the one in charge for those trainings or those needs in that moment was the talent management consultant so checking okay what do the employees know what do they need to know what is necessary at this time how can we make this job be done in a better way how can they work in a more efficient way okay so that's the job of this talent management consultant okay just keep in mind what each of them do uh, so later on we will come to use uh, this vocabulary okay well right now you're going to work in pairs and you're going to go complete this form. See? You're going to fill in the form for the RC company. That's the name of the company, RC, and explain them to a classmate. So you complete. First, you have the job title. What is the job title that you have? What is the work location, the department? Who do you report to? Are you full-time or part-time? Full-time is, if, well, in some companies, full-time is eight hours while in a day, right? While in other jobs, full-time means 10 hours a day, depending on the company or depending on the job that you have, right? What are the essential duties and responsibilities? You're writing them here. What is about, what about education and work experience requirements? What do you need? Remember yesterday we were saying if, if for that type of job that you are applying to, you need to be, you need to have a bachelor degree in, in what? So what is the degree that you need to have for that position? What is the experience that you need to have for that position? If you remember in the, the, the information we were reading yesterday, for some positions, it was necessary to have five years, for others six, for others three, and for others only one. So how many years of experience do you need to have for your work position, okay? And then at the, at the end, the employee name, that will be your name, and the employee signature, that will be your signature, okay? So that's what you're going to complete. First, you do it alone. You do it just for you, your, your space. And when I send you to the rooms, you're going to share your information that you have with your partner. So you're going to explain the the form or how you completed the form to your partner and your partner will share his or her information to you and it's in that case when you're going to complete this other part okay this one so this is about you and this is about your partner okay But first complete about you. You have in your in your manual, you go to page number 31, page 31, exercise one, right? There you find the, the form for you to complete. Mm -hmm. Ready, ready? Yes. Any question? No question? No question. No question. Okay, perfect. Go ahead then.
Okay. Teacher, una consulta. Ay, el, el, en la cuarta dice el report to informe a, o sea, a, ¿A quién, quién responde. Sí, a quién responde usted. Oh, ok, y la otra es full time, part time. Do you eh, work full time, eh, Jan, eh, Janet, or do you work part time? For example, eh, in some companies, Full time is 10 hours, right? In other full time is eight hours. In most of the companies in El Salvador, full time is eight hours, right? Eight hours. Mm -hmm. A day. Eight. Eight. Eight hours a day. So if you work eight hours a day in the company, you check full time. But if oh, you okay. work only four or five, Well, there are some companies here in El Salvador where the part-time job is six hours. In others, part-time job is, well, in most of the companies, part-time job is four hours, right? Okay. Five or six, depending on the company and the type of company. So it depends. If you have full, if you work full-time job, you put a check here. If you have a part-time job, you put a check here. It depends on the company where you work. Okay, teacher. Thank you. Teacher, I have a question. Uh, only uh, number four. Sorry, it's number four. Reports to what? A num name of my boss or what? Okay, who do you have to report to? To the supervisor, to the floor coordinator? To the manager, who do you report? Okay, okay, to the supervisor. And the number to the work location is the name of my work or what? Yeah, the name of your company. Mm -hmm. Okay, okay, only. Or you, or you can write the address too, right? Ah, okay. The department, remember the department is no San Salvador. Okay, it's like, uh, in my case, accounting. Exactly, the accounting area. The okay. Mm -hmm. okay, thanks. You're welcome.
How are you doing? Teacher, Dígame. what is employee signature? Uh, you sign, su firma. Esa es su firma. Okay. Mm -hmm. How are you doing? Finished, teacher. Excellent. What about the others? One more minute and I send you to the groups, okay? I'm finished. Perfect. I finish. Finish, finish, finish. Gotcha. Let's go then. I'm going to send you in pairs for you to share with your partner that information that you got and you will complete the other chart, the other part of the chart with your partner's information. There you go. Vamos a ver. Carolina y quién es el otro que está trabajando? Yo voy entrando a mi casa ahorita, teacher. Ah, perfecto, Carolina. ¿Quién fue el que me dijo que estaba trabajando? No, me acuerdo. Mi teacher. ¿Quién? David. Ah, bye. <ríe> ok, es que así lo mando en el grupo de tres, David. Joana está en casita, ¿verdad, Joana? Sí, yes, teacher. Ah, sí, ya la vi. Va. Ok, vaya pues, let's go. Ya va llegando, teacher. Hey, excelente, Beatriz. Nice, nice. Mm -hmm. Vamos a ver, try to join. Tengo Nubia, Ana Alicia, José Alfredo, Grace, Beatriz. Beatriz, Beatriz. Ok, perfecto. Mm. 
Una pregunta en español. ¿Qué es lo que es su especialización? ¿La qué? ¿Cómo? Can you do su job leader. Ah, está leyendo. Lo, are you reading my, my profile form? Sí, pero Ajá. Hola. De ese trabajo. Yes, that's my job title. Okay. El mío es accounting. Okay. Eh, World Location S. Z. Consultores. S. Wait, 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 wait. Que no sé cómo escribir. Contador, ¿verdad? Sí, accounting. Hay posturas a favor y en contra de Estados Unidos por su decisión de excluir al gobierno de Daniel Ortega de la Cumbre de las Américas. Que será el en, es que, de, en la otra, en la de la derecha, sería el del compañero. El del compañero, ok. Sí. Sé que como se me reinició el teléfono porque estaba en, en actualización. Vale, y esa sí. la, no se le escuchó a la teacher, pero ok. Ah, pues, si quiere, vamos este, fila por fila y, y yo le leo lo que yo tengo y ahí me dicta lo que usted tiene. Lo que usted... Ok, ok. Vale. Job title, el mío es... President Engineer. Mm -hmm. In my case is a uh, uh, boss, uh, boss, a uh, 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 sucursal boss. Okay. World location. Mm -hmm. En San Miguel, it's mine. Mm -hmm. And yours? En Mayes, en mi case, es Aguachapán. Department, eh, it, to me, is construction supervision. Ok, en mi case, es. Uh, Administrative, administrative position. Reports to, in, in my case, is the project manager. Okay, uh, in my case, I report to, um, In my case, I don't have a, a, a name department. It's to, in my case, it's a Rosie. <laughs> I report. She is like manager. Yes. Manage, manage. Yes, manage. Uh, my work is in full time. Yes, me too. Okay. Yes, duties and responsibilities. Uh, uh, uh -huh. Uh -huh. I write five, uh, five uh, duties, digamos. Uh -huh, uh -huh. Approve monthly payments to the builder. O sea, aprobar los pagos mensuales al constructor. Uh -huh. Make monthly and quarterly reports. Hacer reportes y e informes mensuales y trimestrales. Uh -huh, uh -huh. Give instruction to the builder. builder. Uh -huh. eh, dar instrucciones al constructor. Keep track of weekly and monthly production and progress. Mantener uh -huh. registros mensuales, semanales y mensuales de la producción y sus avances. Uh -huh. okay. Y evaluate builder performance. Evaluar la, el desempeño del constructor. Desempeño. Uh -huh, uh -huh. Digamos que esas son las principales. The essential duties. And responsibilities. Essential duties. Uh -huh. Ok. In my case, um, 
a greater report, a daily report. Daily report. Mm -hmm. uh, take the temperature for the uh, sales. De, no me recuerdo. <ríe> Lo voy a buscar porque no me recuerdo. Okay. ¿Cómo se dice sala de ventas? Yes. Eh, de, de responsibility, eh, son, la, se refiere a las responsabilidades del departamento donde soy. Uh -huh, sí, deberes y responsabilidades. Ok. Teacher, ¿verdad que este donde dice el department es eh, el área de trabajo? Área. Exacto, ¿en qué departamento está usted? Okay. Compras, okay. purchases, ¿verdad? Purchases, ajá. Ah, purchases. Purchases. Es que la compañera lo está llenando porque se acaba de conectar. Ah, ok, ok. Sí, iba de viaje todavía, dijo. No, bueno, va llegando a la casa. No es que se acabe de conectar, no sé, pero va llegando. Ajá, es que iba, iba de viaje. No, teacher, yo no. Acá, no estaba en casa. ¿Verdad que iba de viaje? No, teacher. ¿No iba de viaje? No, había salido con, con, con mi mamá. Vaya. Y ya regresé con mi mamá chiquince. Uh -huh. Vaya, iba de viaje. Oh, <ríe> es que ella quiere bien subirse bien. a un carro. Ah. Ah, no, no. Sí. <ríe> yo ya alcancé, ni alcancé a escuchar la lista. Mm. Ya vamos a pasar otra vez la lista. Sí, súper rápido va el tiempo. Ok. Mm. The education and world experience requirements. Eh, en, los, en los requerimientos de estudio, teacher, son los que exige el puesto. Exactly, exactly. Remember yesterday we were mentioning if you need a bachelor degree in, okay, in business or okay, depending on, on the position, right? Okay. Teacher, ¿esto cómo termina la semana? Teacher? Hoy termina la semana. No, pero ¿cómo la termina? Yo ahorita me siento sí. molida. Lo más para aguantar. Sí. Ajá. Así terminamos la semana que ya, ya, ya queremos que sea medianoche. <risa> sí. Yo creo que todo, ¿verdad? Todos nos pasa eso. Sí, es que viernes y todo el cuerpo lo sabe. Exacto, exacto, ya, viernes, es así como que vamos a dormir ya temprano. <ríe> sí, pesadita la semana. Me dice que viernes 13 la panza te crece. <ríe> I didn't know that. <ríe> I didn't know that, that's good. Ay, no, uy, no, ya no pasa. Ya no, ya. Qué tremendo, imagen. Ya no, ya no, ya suficiente. Ay, no. Es que 
hoy cada ocurrencia, ¿verdad? Ay, sí, usted, qué bueno. <risa> Pero se está bueno, ese no me lo podía yo. No, lo acabo de ver por el ahí. Meme. Ay, yo creí que me, me lo acabo de inventar yo. No, 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 un meme, un meme vi, viernes 13, la panza te crece. Oh, my God, no, ya no, ya no, ya suficiente. Ya de ver películas de miedo. Exacto. Ah, pues no, solo a los que ven películas de miedo que les crezca la panza. Ajá. Ok, finish Beatrice. Eh, solo la, me falta una un requisito. Ok, si no, no le damos. Así que, por eso son los 10 years of experience. En mi caso, no requiere the experience. Ya uh, okay. es is, is, uh, is, uh, is silly, probably. <laughs> I think it's most of, uh, como se dice, uh, de la actitud, ¿verdad? Uh -huh, uh -huh. No a la actitud. Yes. Uh -huh. yes. It's, a, it's a only aptitude <laughs> for the work. <laughs> Uh, for this for this case is este uh, en el quiero ver chol chol turki no sé cómo se pronuncia título chol title 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 de Romana, de World Location, Ajá. San Roque, el Paz. lugar o oh, es la dirección. Ah, eso yo también tenía una duda con eso, pero yo le puse el, el, la dirección, teacher, es correcto. ¿El qué? ¿En World Location? En Workplace. Sí, puede poner la dirección del lugar, de la empresa. Okay. Uh -huh. <coughs> Porque yo solo le había dejado San Roque Pharmacy, Tich. ¿Qué did you say? En World Location solo le había dejado San Roque Pharmacy. Ah, no, pero es que es la dirección, entonces. Sí, pero es que Pharmacy no nos dice Ajá. Es el nombre, pero a pero dónde. Pues, Ajá, la dirección. Además, la dirección. Ajá. Yes, yes. Ok. Ya lo voy a corregir. En duties and responsibilities, lo que uno hace o el, con lo que debe cumplir. ¿verdad? Sí, sí. ¿Para qué lo contrario? Podría poner, ah, podría poner algunas actitudes que... ¿Cómo decir? Cuando ponen puntual, good expression. No, uh, no, pero, no. pero, pero ahí creo que son las. Vamos a ver. Porque sí, sí puse lo que requiere sí, la plaza. ¿verdad? ¿verdad? Essential uh -huh. duties and responsibilities. ¿Cuáles son sus obligaciones? Eh, install. Explain to the customers the uh, function of the equipment, uh, machine, uh, repair the equipment, etc. Ajá. Ah, pues eso, eso. Your responsibilities son las que van allí. Okay. Ah, y en education, education and work experience, yo le puse eh, technician uh -huh. or engineer degree in area electrical, mechanical or electro, electromechanical. 
Minimum one year of the experience in the area. Ajá. Uh -huh. Exactly, exactly. The experience, how many years of experience in the, in the area, right? Mm -hmm. Usually in the area. Mm -hmm. Exactly, that's what you put there. I con employee signature. Es, es su firma. Sí. Oh. Esa es la firma suya. Y en el plugin. Mi nombre. And what about you? What about your partner? Yo no lo he terminado, teacher. Ahorita voy a la mitad. Rellenándolo como lo mismo. Ok. De camino, sí. Me he quedado ahorita. Haciendo esto. Yes. Cost the products and check invoices. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Only one. Okay. Eh, yo siento que he aprendido bastante. Hi, teacher. Hi, hi. ¿Cómo vamos? Ya terminamos. Compartimos the information. Ok, you completed your partner's information too? Yes, teacher. Ok, perfect, perfect, perfect. Voy a ver otro grupo, que hay algunos que aún no terminan. Ok, teacher. Thirty minutes. Thirty minutes uh, in uh, eight hours to go to, to the bathroom. To, to go to the bathroom, uh, eat something fast. So you have one hour to eat for lunch, for example. Yes. Okay. One in, hour for lunch. Uh -huh. In have thirty minutes free. To for go to the to bathroom, go to the bathroom, drink water, do something, or whatever you want. do something, don't have to do something, whatever you want. I want. And if you want to walk for a, a go for a walk, if you have been there only sitting for eight hours, it's difficult. <laughs> yes, it is very difficult <laughs> because only thirty minutes uh, go to the bathroom one. Once uh, go to the bathroom, uh, maybe once a day, or you can separate, for example, 10 minutes in the morning, 10 minutes in the afternoon, and 10 more minutes later. Or uh, you 10 have minutes the... Uh, to the eight hours. Ah, okay. Yes. Was difficult. But yeah. 30 minutes. Okay. Sorry, I can hear you, teacher. 30 minutes every day. Every day. When I was a worker in a call center. Okay, okay, okay. Actually, I work in a bank. Now you have more time, or it's like they are not counting the time? Now I have the all the time. <laughs> uh -huh, okay. You can go wherever you want. Yes, I can eat in my position work. Uh, see my 
cell phone, see my social media, uh, whatever I want. Ah, that's okay. That's okay because it's a best place Definitely. now. Definitely. And when you were working in the at the call center, uh, you felt happy or you were like, I don't want to be here. I was stressing, estresado. Huh? <laughs> stressing because I have one call, then other call, then other call, all the day. One call after another one, very uh, call, call. right? Right. No, it, it, is it like maquila? I don't know how to say it. Yes. Are you okay? like, okay. well in one minute me lo llevo. Okay, we are six right now. Nice, nice. A ver, ¿cuántos faltan? Oh, ahí vienen corriendo ya. <ríe> ok, ok. A ver, ¿was it easy to complete all that information? Yes. Yes or no? Mm. What is the question, teacher? Sorry. Was it I easy, easy, easy to complete that information? Yes. Yes. Yes, easy. Yeah, right? Because it's something that you know, it's about your position. So you. No. <laughs> no, it's not about your position. No, it's about me. What? It's about my partner. <laughs> no? It's about my partner. <laughs> no, you didn't. No, but, but it's a, it's a easily. Describe <laughs> you your position. Yes, teacher. Okay, because remember, first thing was uh, you describe your position, and then your partner describe it. <laughs> Luis Mauricio wants to be the first one to share yes. with us. Yes. <laughs> okay. Share, Luis Mauricio. Oh, pero wait, está salvado por la campana. We will go for the attendance first. Okay, teacher, okay. <laughs> salvado. <laughs> Adriana Marcela. Present teacher. Analicia. Present teacher. Carolina. Present teacher. Claudia Carolina. Present teacher. Diego. Present. Edwin Mauricio. Present teacher. Elvin. Grace Michelle. Present teacher. Joanna. Present teacher. Jonathan. Present teacher. Jose Alfredo. Present teacher. Karen Elena. Karen Elena. No. 
torturada en el día. La niña fue torturada por Karen Janet, por miembros de esta congregación, quienes la sujetaron con el cuello en la cintura para que vomite. Present teacher. Porque según ellos. Carla Lorena. Present teacher. Carla Patricia. Present teacher. Luis Edgardo. Present teacher. Luis Mauricio. Present teacher. Nubia Zulema. Present teacher. Rosa Hilda. Present teacher. David. Perdimos a David. Present teacher que no podía descargar la máquina. Ah, ok, ok. Oscar Mauricio. Oscar. No, here Oscar. Beatriz. Present teacher. Ok, está aquí. Yo feliz estaba, yo dije, oh, será el día, pero no. Nos faltan dos. Que sean tres, dicho. No, porque que nunca hemos estado todos. Eso es cierto. Nunca, sí, 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 nunca, nunca, nunca. Ya el día que estén todos voy a faltar yo. No, teacher. Yo no. Y así nunca, nunca hemos estado completos. Exactly. No falta uno. Vaya. A ver, Luis Mauricio, you turn to report. My, prof my profile. Ok. Uh -huh, uh -huh. The job title eh, is a sucursal. I, I, <laughs> I switch the branch branch a branch porque sucursal no, no existe Ajá, lo mismo que tiraba a la teacher a ver branch branch boss branch Word location branch manager oh. like manager no boss. Right. I like it. Okay. <laughs> okay. Board location is a Wachapan. Okay. Department is a administrative administration. <laughs> Reports to manager is a Rossi manager. <laughs> My work is a full time in a Extra hour. <laughs> and then essential duties and responsibilities. In the essential and the principal are uh, write report, uh, say the temperature for sales, uh, sales, I don't remember you say, Sala de ventas. Sales. Espérame, ya me olvidó. Igual, por eso le he dejado sales. <ríe> le dejé sales. Okay. Sales area. Ajá, the sales area. Ajá, ok. And say the temperature for my uh, so refrigerator. Ok, ah, you take, you check the temperature of the refrigerator. Yes. The medicine has to be there in refrigerator. Yes. yes. Okay. okay. In all days. Uh, it's a daily report. Every day? Every day. Every yes. day. Yes. Mm -hmm. okay. Every day. And take notes for uh, uh, laboratories. Uh, five or 16 uh, products for the laboratory. Uh, say the not uh, if the inventory is is a uh, is a uh, correct with the physical and system. Okay. Uh, then 
another's another's uh, responsibilities responsibilities yes uh -huh. education and work experience requirements uh, I don't remember but uh, I need a high school and experience if if I si no me equivoco eh, require a, a high school oh okay high school and, and experience is uh, another similar similar position employee name name is me <laughs> Luis Mauricio <laughs> ¿Cómo? ah okay the employee name <laughs> Employee uh -huh. name. <laughs> An employee signature. I don't I don't know. <laughs> Your signature. La firma. Ah. Uh -huh, that's the la firma that you do. Okay. Mm -hmm. But I, I Luis Mauricio. <laughs> it's my signature. <laughs> okay. That is all, teacher. <laughs> okay, perfect. Perfect, perfect. One more volunteer. Choose a victim. Choose a victim, sí, a veces es mejor. Yes, teacher. Who will be the victim? Uh, Karen Janet. Vaya, Karen Janet. <laughs> Salió sorteada. Yes, teacher. Okay, because she, yeah. she said, me, me. <laughs> to be the volunteer. Yes. <laughs> okay, teacher. Uh, yo, title or title? Title. Uh, yo, title. <laughs> Bachelor's degree in business administration. World location, Mejapa. Department credits in collection, mm -hmm. report to administrative boss, a full time, in essential duties and responsibilities, a supervise the sale, call the clients, send reports, attend calls, in education and work experience. Experience requirements, 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 a bachelor's degree in business administrative, a two years of experience. Okay. Business administration is required for that. Business yes. administration. Administration. Okay. No, administrative. No, administration. Business administration. Hey, employee name, Karen Cruz. Okay. Finish this. Nice, nice. Okay, perfect. Now let's move. Let's move, let's move here. I'm going to share. as we completed here, right? Now, look at this vocabulary. You have a recruiting coordinator. Remember at the beginning of the class, we were talking about this, these jobs, these uh, positions. A recruiting coordinator, benefit specialists, human resource generalist, administrative assistant, compensation specialists, and the talent manager consultant. Mm -hmm. So what you're going to do now is match, match these positions to the correct definitions, okay? They are there on page 32, page 32. So you have the vocabulary on page, on activity two, right? And you have the definitions on activity three. 
So match the positions with the definitions. Mm -hmm. I'm going to share with you uh, the information that we were discussing at the beginning, right? There in the chat. I'm gonna stop sharing here. I'm going to share that in the in the chat for you to, to check if you need to if you need to check that information. A ver, WhatsApp is disconnected right now. Yeah. I'm going to share there. Let's wait for it to connect. Ahí está. Mauricio Castro. ¿Quién es Mauricio Castro? Edwin. No, teacher. Another Mauricio. Oscar. Oscar Mauricio. Ah, Oscar Mauricio. Ah, no, no, no. Mm -hmm. Oops. Oh, oh. Okay, bueno. Esperemos que no vea que todo le salga bien aquí a Oscar. Bye. Ahí va, eh, that is recruitment coordinator. Mm, I'm going to chair the, 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 the administrative assistant. The other one is benefits specialist. We have the compensation specialist. Ah, yeah. The human resource generalist. And the last one, that is the talent management consultant. Okay, so go through the information again if necessary, right? And then you complete the exercise you complete the exercise. Vamos a ver. <coughs> uh, exercise three, where you have to match the positions in part two with the definitions. Ready for that? Yay, teacher. Yes. Yes. Teacher. Yes. <laughs> yes, teacher. Bye, I'm going to send you in groups of three now. No, teacher. No, teacher. <laughs> okay. okay. Bye. Groups of three. Uh, one group of four. Okay. Vamos a ver. Okay. Allá vamos, chicos. Ay, no, yo ando tapada la chata. No sé por qué. Try to join. Gracias. Sí.
¿Alguien va a compartir la pantalla o se las comparto? Si gusta, compártalo porque yo tengo impreso el material. Vamos a unir, ¿verdad? Lo... Yeah, you have to match. match. Ok. Esa parte, ¿verdad? Sí. Vaya. Ahí está. Repeating coordinator es talent management consultant. Pero estoy ¿Creen que va así? Espérame, 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 estoy leyendo. Porque el coordinador de... Recording, reading, el co recording coordinator teacher es como el eh. check the information I checked with I shared with you in the, in the WhatsApp. Ah, ahí está toda la 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 de okay. bueno. ahí está la descripción de qué es qué es Right, what are his duties? Ya lo vio. Sí, sí, sí. En la primera dice Facility the Movement of Candidates through the Recruitment Process. Sí, ajá, él dice que es el encargado de reclutar, reclutar a los candidatos. Sí, y, creo que sería y, como... y, y, y de coordinar responsabilidades, dice. Ajá. Entonces para mí sí sería como un asistan lo que les gusta en el otro es que no puedo salirme de ambos. Bueno, Yo leamos que... todos. Luego va el otro dice benefit specialist are an integral part of a company. RH personal department. Maybe number three. Number three, where? Um, yeah, it could be. Yeah, I think. So. Uh, our general list. Okay. Now, a compensation, compensation special. Do you want to read, Rose? Okay. Okay. I try. Works in a company, human resource, or personal department. Pues no, no me equivoco. ¿En cuál? En esta, porque, o sea, lo que se acaba de leer, works in a company, human resource, or personal department. Vea. Sí, right. So here is a compensation specialized. Compensation. Sí, con a compensation session specialist. Specialist. Okay. Uh -huh. Continue. Siempre lo leo. Sí. Okay. Yes. Works in a company, human resource, or personal department. A compensation specialist job description varies in complexity based of the employer's size and needs. Some companies employ human resource gener generalists was responsibilities. 
include, include aspects of compensation, while other companies need the advanced skills and knowledge of a specialist focus only on compensation. 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 Okay. Es que se me va como te. <laughs> okay. The next one. Next Requirement one. coordinators. If you want to read. Requirement, requirement coordinator. Yes. Facility the movement of candidates through the recruitment process. Recruiting coordinator responsibilities entail everything from posting open position to job boards. Coordinate candidate travel, scheduling interviews across the departments, handling last minutes schedule, scheduling. I don't know. <laughs> Scheduling, ¿verdad? Scheduling. Scheduling, interview across departments. Handling last minute scheduling change, creating offer letters, conducting background checks and smoothing over any, any other speed bump. Teacher, speed bumps, bumps, what's the mean? Speed. Speed booms. ¿En cuál número está? Vamos a ver. The equipment coordinator. Are you adding the descriptions? In the mm. descriptions? Yes, teacher. Yes, 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 perdón. Okay. Es que okay. eso se le iba a preguntar, pero se me olvidó. O the recruiting coordinator. Recruitment coordinator. Uh -huh. Which Teacher. is your question? A ver. Uh, what's the mean speed bumps? So if there, if there are any como problems, digamos, in the middle of, of, the, of the hiring process, it has to accelerate everything. Mm, okay. Es como un modal. Un idiom. No, no. It's, it's just a. Expression. Uh, uh -huh. okay. In the hiring Los process. Bombs. Los bombs son como, como baches, right? Vamos. Okay. So that's why I tell you, if there are any problems, why. Para salir del bache, por decirlo así, rápido. Uh -huh. For example, if there are any problems in the process of hiring somebody, he will move quickly. So he will speed like, pasemos, ya, 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 aceleremos. Okay. Para que no sea muy engorroso el proceso. So that, mm. that's his job. Okay. A speed booms in the hiring process. The job of a coordinator starts when candidates respond to a job opening and ends when the organization fills the position in question. Mm -hmm. mm. I think it could be the number one. Mm -hmm. No, no. Uh -uh. Or yes. Yeah. Yeah. I think number one. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Try. Re 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 coordinator. Coordinator. Um, pero... ¿Pero qué? Supervisa, ¿verdad? Ajá. No, pero... Yo no tengo dudas. Ajá. The great fácil de movement of candidate through the recruitment process. Recruitment. 
in the everything from posing and present job for Courtney Candy through schedule. Es que, I think it couldn't be number two because it says that he, the, it says the job of a coordinator starts when candidates respond to a job opening and ends when the organization fills the position in question. So it's only when the company is looking for a employee. So it could be number two. No, it doesn't number two. Uh -huh. yes, and or number five, it could be. Okay, number one is uh, la número uno es como que supervisa uh -huh. los procesos prácticamente y aquí está hablando. Ah, sí, pero sí, 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 sí. El qué? Que ya me confundí. <laughs> Amen. Oh, I management. Okay. Efficient, efficiency. Okay. But if you want, uh, I'm gonna read the number, the next one, and then we try to to put. To, to match the position. Mm. Okay, benefits specialists are an integral part of a company's HR department. These individuals are responsible for managing and administrating a company's employees' benefit and compensation program, from retreatment plans and health insurance to life insurance and beyond. Mm. Insurance. Insurance. Okay. Insurance. Uh, okay. I don't know. A talent management consultant make staff development development needs assessment assessment. She identifies and manage staff training needs that will motivate high quality workforce space workforce and develop their skills towards greater efficiency efficiency uh -huh. i don't know <laughs> okay. a little bit okay let's start but the number three we are short very short that is a compensation special and then an administrative is uh, okay. So I think number one, it could be administrative assistant. Number five. What do you have in number five? Mm, I think administrative assistant. Mm, the administ administrative assistant. Mm -hmm. And the number six. The recruiting coordinator. Mm -hmm. 
Ajá, sí. In the number two, it's not clear. Maybe human resource generalist. In the number two. I think I finish. Okay. Vamos a ver. I guess it's enough time for everybody. Let's go. Okay. Okay. Ready to check? Yes. Okay, very good. Vamos a ver. Everybody here? Gracias. Nos falta quien se nos ha quedado perdido por allí. O se perdió del todo en el camino. Alguien se nos perdió. Vaya. Probable teacher. Sí, siempre se nos pierde alguien. Y el camino. Ahí está. Es. Vaya. A ver. Eh, remember, we're matching the positions here to the definitions, right? Overseas both the talent review and the performance management. Who? Who? I think the talent manager consultant. Okay, talent manager consultant. Vamos a ver. Vamos a recortar. Pégate. Ya me está regañando aquí, Teams. Digo Zoom. Vaya, that's the talent manager consultant, right? What about the number two? Develops appropriate strategies for clients regarding employee relations, disciplinary action operations. No le oigo que alguien sepa ni cheque qué es lo que le está haciendo mucho sonido ahí. En la dos, entonces sería HR Generalist. Human Resources Generalist. All of you agree with that? Yes, teacher. Um, 
human resources. General. A ver, number three, works in a company, human department. Works in a company's human resource or personal department. Compensation specialist. Compensation specialist? Mm -hmm. yes. 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 Yes, teacher. Mm -hmm. Okay. Doesn't give much characteristic of the job, right? Here. Okay. What about uh, number four is responsible for assisting with the administration of all benefits. That's benefits easy. Special. That's easy. That's the benefits specialist. Yes. Number five, handles administrative requests and queries from senior managers. Administrative assistant. The administrative assistant. See. Ah, qué chistoso, esperen. Uh, number six, designs and implements overall recruiting strategy. Recruiting coordinator. The recruiting coordinator. Okay. Nice. Any questions over there? No questions, observations? No. No questions. Okay, perfect. Now, your job now here is to write sentences about people in your company and their positions, yeah? Using these words. Recruiting coordinator, benefit specialist, human resource generalist, administrative assistant, compensation specialist, talent management consultant. Okay. So you have this space, write sentences about people in your company and their positions. Of course, you're going to write six sentences, right? And I know in our companies, we do not count with all these people, right? Sometimes as you were mentioning yesterday, human resources department is only the, the, the secretary or the assistant to probably a human resource generalist if we're lucky, right? So I'm going to let you open here for you to write the sentences about different people in your company. So include, of course, as much as you can, human resource positions, right? But if you don't have much, or you don't, there are not many people in the human resource department, you can write about any other positions in your company, okay? I'm going to give you a couple of minutes for you to do it, and then we will check it here, I'm not going to send you to the rooms anymore. This is a moment for you to work in the bit. Okay. Go ahead. I guess um, six minutes, right? One minute per sentence, and then we check together. So write sentences about people in your company, people in your company. Mm -hmm. 
Like for example, teach. Like all what we have been talking about today. So you can talk about different positions. Like, uh, remember we have been talking about the characteristics and the descriptions, the duties that the people have. For example, if you say, well, the person who is in charge of hiding in my company is, and then you tell me who it is, right? Oh, okay, mm -hmm. okay, I got it, thank you. You can include the, the um, for example, if you say a human resource specialist, should have uh, three years of experience to be hired in my company. So we have been talking about the education, we have been talking about experience, we have been talking about the characteristics or descriptions of the jobs. We have also been talking about the duties. So you can include any of those topics or those things at the moment of writing the sentences about the people in your company. Okay, let me know when you're ready so we can check. 
or chair. Okay, who will be my first volunteer? Let me see, I'm going to look for a volunteer. Joanna, tell me one. At my company, all employees work full time. Okay, thank you, Joanna. Adriana Marcela. Give me one example. At my work, all employees uh, are responsible. Responsible, responsible. 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 Mm -hmm. responsible. Very good. Thank you, Adriana. Beatriz. Only one. No here, Beatriz. No teacher. Okay, just one, Beatriz. Tell me. Okay, Carolina. Carolina, no here either. Claudia Carolina. In my company, all people work like a team. Okay, thank you, Claudia. Let's see, uh, David. David, David. Me teacher. In my company, the administrative assistant uh, is in charge of supervision that everyone, everyone's activities uh, are carried out in time establishment. establishment. The time is established. Okay. Excellent, Karen. Karen, thank you very much. Let's see, Diego. In my company, all the employees work eight hours a day. Nice, nice, nice. Edwin? In my company, the talent, talent management consultant send us every two weeks uh, emails for training in, in, for internet. So you have the, the training online? Online. Okay, per online. perfect, perfect. Thank you, Edwin. 
Grace Michel. Grace, Grace. No here, Grace. Um, Jonathan. Okay. Uh, the quality is in charge of the quality area. Okay, excellent. Thank you, thank you. Jose Alfredo. Only one, 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 one. The administrative top. assistant is a person very kind and punctual. Okay, excellent. Karen Janet. In my company, the accounting assistant pre prepares monthly inventory. Okay, excellent. No falta Carl, Karen, no, Carla Lorena, Carla Patricia. Luis Edgardo, Nubia, Luis Novesa. Ok, Karen, pa Carla Patricia. In my company, the auditor check the report of cashiers and receptionists. Ok, excelente. Carla Patricia. What about Carla Elena? Carla Elena. Lorena. Ay, Lorena. Ah. Ya me cambió el nombre. Ya le cambié. Mire, a usted no le había a todos, casi que a todos le he cambiado. ¿Va? Ayer le dije a, 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 ¿cómo se llama? Creo que fue este niño, Luis Edgardo, que le dije Luis Alberto, no sé. Pues, me ando cambiando nombre. Okay. Imperdonable. Es para que no se aburran del mismo nombre. ¿Qué? Solo porque así se llama mi mamá. Oh, ok. <risa> no. En the company, en the company there are three administrative assistants. One for each project. Ok. And there are three projects. Three projects, so three assistants. Three assistants and three projects. Okay, vamos a ver. Luis Edgardo. Uh, in my company, they, they are for analysts. Uh, they analyze supply chain for follow the, the spash from Centro America, no sé cómo se dice. Central America. Um, y um, uh, to give you tracking uh, the container de USA a um, Costa Rica. Okay. From the USA to Costa Rica, from Costa Rica to El Salvador. No, 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 no. The USA and Salvador, the USA and Honduras, y the USA and Costa Rica. Oh. Ok. Ok, vamos a ver Nubia Sudema. Y después Luis Mauricio. Ok, teacher, my company, the accountant, and he prepared an analyze and interpret financial statements. Okay, thank you, thank you, Nubia. Luis Mauricio. Why teacher, why? <laughs> why me teacher? <laughs> and then Rosie will be the last one. Yes, yes, please. <laughs> Okay, um, a personal administrator uh, is a represent the, the no sé cómo se dice, pero yo lo he dejado así. 
representa represent, representative uh -huh, representative uh, to the management in the others pharmacies. Uh, I don't know. <laughs> okay. okay. In, Spanish, in Spanish, probably says. <laughs> eh, la, los chicos administrativos eh, presentan todo eh, nuestro, nuestro rubro en, otros, en otras empresas. Ah, okay. So mm -hmm. they, they present that from other companies, right? Yes. Okay. Uh -huh. <laughs> and the last one is Rosie before we go to the attendance, right? Because it's 10 o'clock. In my company, the human resource generalist is an industrial engineer and has worked for the company for four years. Okay. Excellent. Vaya, vamos a ver. Eh... Vamos a ver la attendance. Creo que se me perdieron un par por allí. But yeah, tell me present. I'm going to stop sharing. Present. Oh, ya volvieron, mire. Vaya. Adriana Marcela. Adriana. Present teacher. Ana. Present teacher. Carolina. Present teacher. Eh, Claudia, Carolina. Present teacher. Diego. Present. Edwin. Present teacher. Elvin. Present teacher. Okay. Grace Mitchell. Present teacher. Joanna. Present teacher. Jonathan. Present teacher. Jose Alfredo. Jose Alfredo. No está José Alfredo. Con el cero. Ay, no. Vaya. Karen Elena. Karen Elena. Ah, por eso me confundí, mire, Carla. Porque tengo Karen Elena y Carla Elena. Karen Janet. Present teacher. Karen Janet. Karen Stephanie. Present teacher. Carla Lorena. Present teacher. Ok, Luis Edgardo. Present sí, teacher. Pero a mí no me mencionó. ¿A quién? Carla Patricia. Mira, Santi. Vaya, Carla Lorena y Carla Patricia. Vaya, Carla Patricia, sí. Present teacher. Luis Edgardo. Present teacher. Luis Mauricio. Present teacher. Nubia. Present teacher. Rosa Hilda. Present teacher. David. Present teacher. Oscar. Logró entrar Oscar. No sé por qué, pero me quedé sin audio. Beatriz. No sé si me escucha. Sí, 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 sí. Ah, pues present. Sí. ¿Qué vaya, pues? Hoy se queda conmigo Carl, Karen. Número 12, Karen Elena. Karen Elena. 
Okay. Bueno. See you at Monday. Not tomorrow, right? See you Monday. Have a nice day. Good night. Thank you. Good night. Bye bye. 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 Bye b